received an interesting question in conversation the other day. And it's a question that I'm sure is uh, on the forefront of a good number of people's minds, especially now as we're moving to the end of the year, into the festive season and such like. And the question is, number one, should I lose weight or should I buy a lighter bicycle? Obviously, putting down money and buying a lighter bicycle is a way of buying maybe some free speed. But when it comes to cycling, there are two factors that um, hinder your forward momentum on the bicycle. The one is obviously weight. So dropping three kilos by either spending uh, 15,000 rand on a super light bicycle and dropping three kilos will make you lighter. Losing the weight through cycling, through a plant-based lifestyle, losing three kilograms there will make you lighter. However, the second factor when it comes to cycling that makes you faster is wind resistance. And in order to be able to uh, reduce wind resistance, you need to reduce your frontal area on the bike that is being blocked by the wind. So, so, apples for apples, if you lose three kilos of body weight, you'll become thinner. And by becoming thinner, you'll reduce your frontal area, your frontal profile that would be blocking the wind. So, by losing three kilograms of body weight, you will actually make yourself faster than losing three kilograms of bicycle weight, simply because you'll be more aerodynamic as far as your person is concerned. So that's my take on the matter. Share any comments, questions, criticisms you have. Share those in the comment section down below. Don't forget, thumbs up if you like this type of content. Share this out amongst all your uh, cycling, running, triathlon, sporty friends. And last but by no means least, there's a big red subscribe button down there. Hit that subscribe button that way you stay subscribed to my channel for all the new content that comes out to you on a day-to-day, week-to-week basis. Stay carved up for the win out there. I'll see you next time. Cheers.